A little while ago, we saw the first performance results for what is likely the Exynos 1580, Samsung's next mid-range processor. Now, new results have come out from one of the main devices that will use this chip, the Samsung Galaxy A56. As expected, the phone is labeled with the model number SM-A566B, and the chipset is identified as S5E8855. The Exynos 1580 features eight CPU cores, one powerful core running at 2.91 GHz, three mid-range cores at 2.60 GHz, and four smaller cores at 1.95 GHz. The main core in the new chip runs at a faster speed, aiming to boost single-core performance. It could also be a different type of core than the three mid-range ones. Geekbench has also noted the GPU, which is codenamed Angle, and is the Xclipse 540. Last year's chip had an older Xclipse 530 GPU called Titan, which was based on AMD's RDNA 2 architecture. It's likely that the new chip will be upgraded to the more advanced RDNA 3 architecture, especially since the Xclipse 940 GPU and the Exynos 2400 already uses RDNA 3. The Samsung Galaxy A56 was tested with 8 gigs of RAM, but that's not too surprising since the A55 had options for 6 gigs, 8 gigs, and even 12 gigs. What's more interesting is that the A56 was running Android 15, while other devices like the Galaxy S24 Fan Edition launched with Android 14 and a less powerful Exynos 2400 e chip. It's still early to focus on the benchmark scores since the chip has already shown improvements since the first tests were found, and there's plenty of time before Samsung reveals the Galaxy A56. Based on the release patterns of the A55, A54, and A53, we can expect the launch to happen around mid-March. I hope you liked the video. If you enjoyed the video, subscribing to the channel would be greatly appreciated. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.